do it. The good old life, home of Harbor Day. We are in Nebraska. What's going on you guys? Welcome back. So we are at the new apartment getting ready to just we got everything unloaded from the trucks. We yes, I said trucks is in two trucks. Uh, my stuff is still in this U-Haul right here. So I just gotta open it up. We just got we just went grocery shopping. Look at this. Master lock key. If it'll focus. Bent as shit. It's the only thing left in the U-Haul right now is my toolbox. I know it's pretty dark in here. Everything's in the up there in the mom's attic. On this side. And then back here we had a little bit of room. We just got creeper, jack stands, you know, dolly. Bunch of straps. So this is the toolbox. Just needed to grab. Oh, I'm running into everything. So the drawers right now are a complete mess. And it's really dark for you to see, but just needed to grab some pliers really quick. Thank you, snap on. You got the pliers? This camera is super awkward. We're going to be switching to the Sony ZV-1, which is Sony's brand new camera that just released. You won't have like that, I don't know, I guess the background blur right now is pretty good with the lighting, but you will not have the changeable lenses with the Sony ZV-1, but we'll be doing an apartment tour. The place is a mess right now. We'll be doing an apartment tour uh, first thing in the morning, so it'll still be a mess. You guys will just have to deal with it, but it is super cool. The apart, I think the apartment's even cooler than my last one. Don't tell anyone. But we're gonna head right in there, and tomorrow morning we will do the apartment tour. Everything's gonna be a mess. Just deal with it. It's gonna be good. It's gonna get there. Stream room's getting built. Um, Sarah's got to work, so we got a bunch of stuff to do. So we'll just get it all done, and we'll show you guys in the morning. Alright you guys, we are finally all back up, unpacked, well mostly unpacked. It has been a crazy journey so far. I'm sorry, I'm trying to use this gimbal right now just because I got it already set up. It's been a crazy journey so far, but what I do want to say is it's been an amazing journey. It's been really cool. It's been really fun. We got about 90% of everything unpacked in the, the apartment. We're all pretty much moved in. We still got a bunch of cleaning, bunch of unpacking to do, but 90% of all the essential stuff has been done. I'm gonna give you guys just a full walk through the whole apartment really quick, and then kind of wrap up the video from there. It's been a really cool journey. It's been really fun just to kind of like vlog and film this whole process. I know we didn't film enough, but we've been super, super busy and trying to get everything done before I start my job. Sarah's currently at work right now, so it's just trying to get everything done as quick as possible. And we didn't have as much time to like get the shots we wanted to get and film as much as we really wanted to. But without further ado, let's jump right into it. Walk in from the door, we had a light switch, a little baseboard heater. I'm not really sure why they did that. It's a brand new apartment. And just kind of had some issues and then directly from there we go upstairs oh there's Amber hi baby she's a little skittish of the camera so right when you walk up you have like our living room area so this will be like a dining room this is what I'm talking about everything is still needs to be packed up and unpacked at least so we have like our kitchen table we still don't have any chairs we did have to leave those in Colorado. The place is still a mess, you guys. We have all of Amber's dog toys. 
So we've got all of her toys. The TV, we have a fireplace. Couches are kind of set up. We got some... There's Amber's little spot right there, so that's where she kind of hangs out. Um, we have some kind of bookshelves stash like storage stuff that we're not really sure what we're going to do with yet. See right there, she's just going to lay down and she'll just hang out. She's such a good girl. Right, Amber? Alright, so then coming out to the back patio. We have a full back patio. It's about 12 feet by 5 feet wide. 12 feet long ways. Amber absolutely loves it. It's just a really nice place to kind of just hang out, relax. This is kind of our view from our back patio. We have other apartments around. We have a little bit of people below us. There's where we park our cars right there. The weather's not the best right now, but what do you guys say? It's Illinois, it's Wisconsin, so you just gotta take what you can get. So then if we walk back in, we have our kitchen area. So like I said, little dining room area. Kitchen is absolutely trashed right now, but just bear with us, you guys. We are still getting everything unpacked. We just made dinner last night. I still gotta do all the dishes. This is what we have left to do. So we just got a couple things in here. Just a bunch of miscellaneous stuff like candy, medicine, stuff like that. Um, everything is stainless steel appliances. Let me turn some of these lights on. <clears throat> Everything's stainless steel. So you got, if it'll focus. Uh, everything is brand new as well. This apartment is brand new. So everything in here, like the countertops, all of that are brand new. We got a couple fishies. Let's see if they want to come out and say hi. There's one right there. And then this one, she's swimming right there. So we got some fishies. Uh, going to the master, or the, technically this is the master bathroom. This is our spare bathroom right now. So we just have a full, it's a full two bedroom, two full bathrooms. So we have tubs and showers in both of them. We just have a little kitchenette. You guys can see the big gimbal right now. Bunch of perfume, all that type of stuff. I pretty much let her take majority of the apartment. I just wanted the room for all of my streaming stuff. And she's given that to me, so. So we show her some of that stuff. Just more storage in here. Um, going to the bedroom, like I said, everything is pretty much trashed, but. So we have clothes on the floor. We got our nightstand set up, we got the bed set up, we got dressers over here, TV is set up, DVD player, we got some of our paintings and stuff for the canvases that we want to get hung up. More dressers, shelves, all that stuff. We got Amber just hanging out in the bed. Look at Dad, he's so cute. Um, going to here. We have a full walk-in closet here, so we have all of our shelves up top, all the way around. Down below we just have more shelves, and everything is hung up, trying to stay as neat as possible. If we look across the hallway, or across the room, the camera does not have the widest single lens. We have more, a whole closet right here, it's not a walk-in closet, and we actually just got this dresser from Ikea. And the craziest part is, it does not have a top, so we gotta go back and get a top for it. Come on, Gimbal, focus with me. Oh, look at Amber, she's just hanging out. She's like, Dad, what are you doing? Oh yeah, we're filming the whole house. We did this earlier on my live stream. Alright, so getting out of there, back to the kitchen area, we'll go. These are the stairs, so it's really like a, it's like a townhome style apartment, which is pretty cool. So we do have it downstairs. This is just our living or our laundry room. So we got a full size washer and dryer, a little shelf area up there. We did just get this new shark. This is a Shark Rocket Pro 2, Rocket Pet Pro 2. So that's something we just got. Let's get out of there. 
There's really nothing else to see in there. This is where it all comes down to the stream room. So we got the stream room. We still have all of this stuff to put up. These are all just my signs, posters, all that stuff. Everything that needs to get put up. We have our lights right here on the floor. If this damn gimbal will focus, it's not wanting to. But we still have all of our acoustic foam right here that we need to do. We have the gun cabinet, all the ceramic stuff. We have Sarah's desk, which you guys will see right here. So this is just her new desk. It is an electronic desk. So with just a push of a button, it goes up, it goes back down. Pretty cool. It's, what's nice about it is it has a net underneath it so that you can keep all your cables organized and neatly, neatly arranged. We did put this light here. This is a 10,000 lumen Mac work light. So if we want, we can turn that on while she's working. She has a nice area where she can see everything on the desk if she's painting and other stuff like that. Coming over to my streaming area, this, like I said, I know this place is a mess, but we've got my whole streaming area, my three monitors, my computer, my microphone. Um, Sarah painted this little pen holder, so we're saving up all of our pens, of course, so there's freaking everywhere. Um, and then this right here, this will get mounted in front of the desk right here, so that'll be right there for all of our papers, things like that. We have two lights right there, one right there, one is the hair, li hair light right behind us. Camera setup, we did, I just set this up this morning, this is Amber's little temporary doggy bed. So this is her little temporary doggy bed that we're using. We do want to get another one for right here so that she can look out the window. We're going to get like an elevated one so that she can sit there at the window height. Um, the, uh, this is the technically the spare bathroom, but this is just pretty much all of our stuff. This is what we're using as our master bathroom. Same thing, just shower head, all that stuff. Oh, uh, the shower head. Now that I reminded myself. This is a diversion valve, three-way diversion valve shower head. So we can either use this one separately, we can use this one separately, or we can use them both at the same time. This just does come off with a magnet. So that's pretty nice to have. Helps when you're trying to clean the bathtub or anything like that. Um, just another closet right here. This just has a bunch of bath bombs, towels, extra stuff like that. No big deal. And that's pretty much it for our apartment tour. It is definitely, I think it's personally nicer. I don't think it has as much, come on, focus. There we go. I don't think it has as much storage as my last apartment did as far as like cabinet space and bathroom space, things like that. But this does have a double vanity, a double sink in the vanity and things like that, which is really nice that my last apartment did not have. So it's just a really nice little place. Um, I did not show you guys this, but it's really not that important. This is just our streaming room closet. So this is just all of our extra miscellaneous TV mounts, um, all of our extra computer stuff in that box, extra cables in that, more paint, ceramic stuff, we just have our suitcases, bed frame we're trying to get rid of, my bone arrow, golf clubs are over here in the corner, it's hard to see, it's really dark in there. So that's just like a miscellaneous closet. But yeah, so it's been, it's been a cool little journey, I mean, it's been nice to have someone to come home to like if Sarah's at work she can come home and like we're here like Amber's here it's just like a really cool feeling to like have like a family that we just come home to I think that's just really important for me probably the lighting is terrible there we go um so it's just really cool like we have like if I'm here alone I'm not here alone anymore because I have Amber so it just makes it really nice but that's going to wrap up this video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this whole journey. I hope I inspired some of you guys to kind of pursue your passions. I mean, if you really want to do something in life, like don't be afraid or don't think you're too young or too old to go out and do whatever you want to do. We just packed all my stuff up and moved across the country and 
it's been awesome. I mean, the packing sucks, the moving sucks, but other than that, you guys can get through it. If you don't have the extra money, save up a little bit, it will be worth it, I promise you guys. But I do hope you guys were inspired by this whole journey. I think it's been a really cool thing. I've now lived in, I'm 25 years old, and I've lived in four states now. This is the fourth state I've lived in since I was 18. And it's just really cool. It's really cool to go out and see the world, enjoy new things. Colorado is way different than it is here. Here is obviously way different than Colorado or Illinois or Michigan. So it's just really cool to get out and just experience that. Even if it's not something you enjoy or you want to do forever, go out and enjoy it and have fun, visit the world, and just live your life. I mean, that's really what it's all about. But hope you guys enjoyed this type of video. I really enjoyed my part of the video by filming it and showing you guys the whole journey of what we're doing and just a little bit of everything so hope you guys have a good one and I'll see you guys on the next one peace